the Aventador SVJ is the most extreme version of the Aventador, featuring one of the most powerful V12 Lamborghini has ever created. The 6.5-liter naturally aspirated V12 features titanium intake valves, and modified cylinder heads increasing the output to 759 brake horsepower, a 20 brake horsepower increase on the SV. Despite the addition of rear-wheel steering and active aero, the SVJ delivers a 50 kg weight saving over the standard Aventador, which means the SVJ dispatches the 0 to 62 mph dash in 2.8 seconds, and its top speed set at the nominal Italian supercar staple of 217 mph. The emblematic name of the Tour de France was relaunched for the extreme version of the F12. Faster, lighter and packed with new technology, it's a tempting proposition. The Ferrari F12 TDF exudes a desirability and aggression that still makes it one of the most desirable car on sale today. It has a brilliant and balanced front engine, rear-wheel drive, a very exciting V12 engine and numerous cuts, slashes and aerodynamic gadgets that combine motorsport competition and technology. The F12 TDF ups the ante considerably over the standard F12 in terms of drivetrain performance, aerodynamics, lightweight materials and solutions and, of course chassis dynamics. The 6.3-liter naturally aspirated V12 produces up to 769 horsepower at 8,500 rpm and 520 pound-feet of torque at 6,750 rpm. The TDF has a top speed of 211 miles per hour and accelerates to 62 miles per hour from rest in 2.9 seconds, 124 miles per hour in 7.1 seconds. Fast made its debut at the 2017 Geneva Motor Show. The successor to the F12 Berlinetta, the new 812 Superfast fell right in line in Ferrari's two-seater, front-engine V12, rear-wheel drive, Grand Tourer segment, marketed by Ferrari as, the fastest and most powerful Ferrari yet. The 812 Superfast is powered by a 6.5-liter naturally aspirated V12 compared to the outgoing 6.3-liter found in the F12. The engine design puts out an astonishing 785 brake horsepower and 530 pound-feet of torque, which according to Ferrari, at the time of its release, was the most powerful naturally aspirated production car engine ever produced. The 812 Superfast achieves 0-60 mph in just 2.8 seconds, and is capable of a top speed of 211 mph. Ferraris are unique by nature, the prancing horse badge honors the company's more than 80 years of involvement in races, and its more than seven decades of swoon-worthy production vehicles and the 2023 Daytona SP3, is one of those Ferraris that stands out from the crowd. With multiple scoops and intakes cut into the slinky bodywork that improve aerodynamics and power plant cooling, the SP3 is a contemporary work of automotive art. Based on the 2015 LaFerrari Aperta the Daytona is even wider, which endows it with a menacing presence. The Daytona SP3 is all new and will only be in the Ferrari lineup for the 2023 model year. Just 599 examples are being built, and all have already been sold. The Daytona SP3 is propelled by the most powerful combustion engine ever used in a Ferrari road car, a naturally aspirated 6.5-liter V12, motor borrowed from the 812 competition that has been boosted by 10 ponies for a total of 829 horsepower. The V12, which revs to 9,500 rpm, also produces a healthy 514 pound-feet of torque, and the engine's output is routed to the rear wheels through a 7-speed dual-clutch automatic gearbox. Considering the power-to-weight ratio, you should have no problem hitting 60 miles per hour in under 3 seconds even if power is sent only to the rear wheels. 100 miles per hour should be reached in less than 6 seconds, with the SP3 hitting a claimed top speed of 211 miles per hour, 